Hello, um, I wanted to do a video talking about this movie that I watched tonight. It was called The Hundred Foot Journey and it was so good. Like, um, I watch movies all the time, like um, every week almost at the cinemas with my friends. And I wait like years in between movies that are this good. Like, uh, when I was watching it, I was thinking to myself, because um, my, my, some of my favourite movies are like Titanic and um, Return of the King, Lord of the Rings and stuff like that. And I was thinking to myself, like, um, in the genre of like food movies, this is like the Titanic or the Lord of the Rings of that genre. Like it's just like something that's so entertaining, so awesome on every level, on many, many, many levels. It's just so entertaining for for the whole way through. Um, just a movie that I can wholeheartedly recommend to, but mainly to people who love food. I think and well, the food is like a vehicle for just the, the story and the. Um, also the message in the movie as well. Um, basically the plot of the movie is um, there's these um, this family from India who, you know, they, they, were, they were cooks, in, they, were, they had a restaurant and stuff in India and then, you know, for circumstances, they had certain circumstances, as they, well, they had to go to England, London, um, and then um, from there they decided to move to Europe because um, they love food and they felt like just that was where the place to be like you know France they love food Europe they just love food and kind of thing like that so um the movie was fantastic like it won me over from the from the start from the first scene right through to the end it was just beautiful to look at um I really like the actors who were in this movie um the I'll, I'll read out their names because they're really good um Manish Dale who played Hassan who's the main guy who's the Indian who's a really good chef um, there was Charlotte Le Bon, who played Margaret. She was really pretty, and she was just awesome as the character. I really liked the chemistry between the two characters. Um, there was um, Om Puri, who played the papa, and Helen Mirren, who played um, the kind of like the restaurant owner across the road. Um, I won't say the whole plot, but basically, if you watch it, you'll or if you watch the trailer, you get the idea. Like you know, they they have their Indian restaurant other side of the road they have like this fancy French restaurant and so it's just awesome like the movie is fantastic um first of all because I personally love food I love cook I enjoy cooking when I do do it I just love it so this movie is like revels in it um and it's not like a movie that's I just felt like it was just a movie of imagine like you went to a restaurant right and there's a chef made something amazing like when you ate it it just blew your mind imagine that chef was a director and he was a good director as good a director as he was a chef that's what this movie is like to me like it was just like amazing meal like amazing dish that's how this movie was like so many elements going on you know like the beautiful scenery the the awesome characters the awesome storyline the meaningful storyline too because um it's kind of like uh, almost in my head when I was watching it, like I just felt like it was kind of like an analogy for the world and like how the world's coming together and you know to get through this life, it's so much better if we you know are friends and people you know not just instead of a war, it's like they're like learning from each other and stuff like that. It's just an awesome, awesome movie. I can't recommend it highly enough. And just to say the whole story of how I ended up watching it, it's like, um, I wanted to kind of watch it when I saw the trailer. I was like, oh yeah, I like Helen Mirren a lot. So I was thinking, yeah, I, I would totally watch that. But um, it wasn't until like one of my friends at work, Cheryl, uh, she she told me um, this week, she said, oh, she watched a movie that was really good. Um, she said, this movie, the, the 100 Foot Journey, and she was just saying how good it was. And she said, I probably would like it. So I put it in my head like that's a recommendation and today um, when it came to picking what movie to watch, um, yeah I was like I want I wouldn't mind seeing this movie and um, uh, one of my other friends wanted to see um, some other movie with Ethan Hawke, um, uh, uh, pre, pre, predisposition or something like that, something like that. Um, but it wasn't out yet, so we ended up watching this, and I'm, I'm quite glad we watched it. So it was, it was good to see it on the big screen, because it's, like, fantastic. It was just really, it was really well directed. There were a lot of funny moments. Um, like, the dad, he's, like, typical dad of, like, you know how when you're, like, growing up as a migrant, and how 
you kind of like feel embarrassed by your parents sometimes because they 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 got the um the stuff they act kind of like how they work back home and you kind of you kind of feel embarrassed about that they showed a lot of this stuff in the movie like the way the dad acted but he's great like and oh can't say enough about this movie awesome 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 it makes me want to go eat indian food like next time in the food court i'm you know how there's all these choices at different places i'll probably next time i'll probably end up going indian uh i don't know what else to say except uh, i at the end of the credits that's when we realized that um the two of the producers were Steven Spielberg and Oprah Winfrey, so that's like whoa. <laughs> and, and also, I want to say like uh, when I first saw this trailer for this movie, I thought, oh well, Helen Mirren's like the star and she'll carry this movie and make it awesome. But really, when I look at this movie, it's like she didn't need to carry it. It was like this movie is awesome and she's just like extra awesome on top of it, like a meat pie that's awesome. And then you add sauce, tomato sauce, and it becomes even more awesome. So. It, yeah, it wasn't her carrying the movie. This movie was fantastic on its own, and she added to how awesome it was. She was really good. Like, oh, Helen Mirren, of course. You know, you know how good she is. Um, so I think this movie would really appeal to people who like romance in their movies. Like, it's I felt it was quite romantic, which is nice. Like, but not like sappy romance. It was like nice romance. Like, kind of like how I like Titanic. It's not like, um, yeah, it's just it was really nice. If you like food especially, I think you'll really appreciate this movie because these people are passionate about food and stuff like that. And I just love the messages in the movie, like, you know, family and stuff like that. Awesome, 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 awesome. One of my favourite movies I've ever seen, so that's all I can say about it, I guess. Uh, the 100 Foot Journey, I recommend it.